Guys, you need a harvest build in your life because materials are expensive. Hell, a masterwork ember by itself is 5,000 gold. And I don't know about you guys, I have no idea on how to earn coin fast. As far as I know, it just like randomly comes and then you get also a share from your alliance. But outside of that, there doesn't really seem to be an easy way to obtain these embers as well as other crafting components, both of which you'll run out of, especially when crafting that god roll masterwork. And for those that don't know, yes, once you obtain a weapon, or in my Titan's case, a heavy assault launcher or an ordnance launcher, inside of our journal are blueprint requirements. And they normally say something like get 10 legendary kills with this particular weapon or that ability, which would then unlock the blueprint to that item and you can then craft it until you get the desired roll. But for many of us, we just run out of materials, which is why a harvest build is absolutely necessary. See right now guys, if you go out into free play and you start hitting up chests in different locations, that's spawns these different materials you'll notice that you only get a slight amount normally it's like one ember maybe two at best but as you begin to stack harvest inscriptions on your different weapons as well as your different components and abilities the materials that you then harvest will greatly go up allowing you to get the most bang for your buck each and every single chest run now again for those that are wondering what the chest locations are ign put out a wonderful guide here to show all of our different chest locations but you want to kind of like hit up all these locations and i like to do this all on grandmaster one i try this on grandmaster one through three we initially thought that Grandmaster 3 affects the rarity of embers from these chests. I don't really know how much of an effect it actually has because I did a lot of Grandmaster 3. It yielded just about the same amount as Grandmaster 1. And if you plan on playing solo and also doing like some world events during the same process, say for instance to complete the Valor quest, this is a great opportunity here to knock out two birds with one stone. Now how much of a harvest bonus are we looking for? Right now, guys, I have 195% harvest bonus. This allows me to get four masterwork embers per chest that drops a masterwork ember. Normally, it's only like one. Now, I believe the way the rates go is that it stays at one ember until 50%. And then 50% to 100% is two embers, 100 to 150 is three embers, and 150 to 200 is four. I think 200 and plus, it goes to five. And I'm not even sure if it ends up capping out. I've only been able to get up to 195 as of right now, because for the longest time, I deleted anything that wasn't aiding my build in combat outside of maybe some rolls that had good luck on it. So going forward, guys, I would highly advise to pay attention to what's dropping for you and start looking for harvest inscriptions to stack with one another when doing these chest runs. It will greatly reward you with materials that you will use most definitely for your builds. Now, for those that don't have any pieces with harvest inscriptions on them, you can go ahead and start crafting certain things. You don't have to craft masterwork here, guys. You can craft just epic or even some blues. But in blues, remember, we only get like two inscriptions. I think epic gives us three. So I'd advise if you have enough epic embers to just start crafting a few things and see what you get on them. I crafted a few support abilities until one of them finally dropped with 30% harvest. And so if you've got enough materials to blow in that department, go right ahead. Because all you're doing with this build, guys, is chest running. You're not needing it to fight unless you are going to be stopping to do some world events and if you are just have a good weapon on you but just craft out some epic gear there that can bump up your harvest percentage and grant you more materials well, guys that's the video just wanted to let you know about the harvest bonuses how much they help i did a lot of runs today and i noticed that chess seemed more slim than normal i'm not sure if like bioware dialed it down a bit in terms of like chess spawns hopefully that was just my experience and that you'll find more chests around the map because today was miserable trying to find chests. Now, before I let you guys go, man, shout out to my Patreon supporters. Much love to you guys. Just want to say thank you so much for directly supporting the channel. Well, fellas and ladies, thank you all for coming and watching. And as always, slap that like button like your mama told you right.